just think that I came into this thing fighting every day to prove I belong, to help them dudes eat. And so I just, that's just a mentality that endured for me. Do you still feel that way? Absolutely. You still feel like you got to prove yourself? Bro, you got championships. Man, I don't care about that. Like, Every day you walk into that, you leave this big ass house because we in your basement. And yep. <laughs> I ain't even been to the fourth floor yet. Hey, hey, <laughs> but we, you hey, walk in every, hey, still to this day, hey, bro. Man. You walk in and had to you hey, you man. think you had to prove yourself. I create comforts for my wife and kids, man. I just lay my head down here until it's time <laughs> to go to work the next damn day. Yeah. You know what I mean? Um, I resist comfort. Um, I ask my guys to resist comfort, right? Guys that played for me, they can tell you. One of my sayings, I got a lot of sayings, is um, don't, seek, don't seek comfort. Seeking comfort is a natural human condition, right? We all want to be comfortable. Um, I realize if you're going to have special outcomes, that you got to be comfortable being uncomfortable. Yeah. And so I've just trained myself over the years to resist comfort. And, and so appreciating my resume is seeking comfort. You know what I mean? Yeah. I get my ass whooped, and I say, huh, but, I, but my resume is such and such. I'm still a Super Bowl champ. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's seeking comfort. Yeah. Like, those that love us most in our business, they do the best job of helping us seek comfort, right? I come into this house, man, and I lose a home game, and my mama's sitting in the kitchen, and she talking about the refs did us wrong, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, Ma, get out of here with that. I don't need that. It stings my ears. I've trained myself to hate it um, because hating it keeps me upright, keeps our program upright. Um, that's just a mode of operation that I'm comfortable with. I, I can't allow myself to do that. You know, um, I think if I did, I think those that I lead would see it. And, and that's not what I'm about. Uh, that's not what I stand before the men and talk about it on a daily basis. And if I talk about it, damn it, I gotta live it. 